Hi, I'm Eddie, and I'll be showing you how to edit web pages on your online business. We've all encountered a familiar problem before, where making changes, even simple ones, to our website usually involves calling up our web designer and telling them what to do. And this is because we didn't want to deal with the technical bits, like uploading and downloading pages and editing HTML. It was all too hard. Not with your online business. We've made website editing so simple and non-technical that you'll have the confidence to take control of your website once I walk you through SiteWalk. You can start SiteWalk by clicking here underneath the Website tab. This is what your website would look like in your visitor's browser. But you'll notice here that you have a SiteWalk menu at the top. And as you hover over the different regions of the web page, you've got the option of clicking to edit those regions. What this will bring up is an editor to let you change your text or your images and then publish them immediately to your live site as it looks. Let's try this with our homepage content. You can see the click to edit region box popping up as I hover over the text. And I just click here to bring up the editor with a copy inside. Now I'm just going to make some small changes. And then all I have to do is hit save and publish. And then close the editor and I'm done. You can see the changes appearing immediately in your site walk. How about images? Well, that's a good question. I'm going to click on the stock image in the middle of the page and this brings it up in an editor. Now I can select the image and I just hit delete and it's gone. To reinsert a new image, I have to click on my image manager, which allows me to select images that have already been uploaded to my site using the file manager or FTP. Here's one I uploaded earlier to my slash images folder. I'm going to select this and click insert and that puts the image in my editor. Now I just hit the save and publish button and there we have it. We've changed our stock image on the front page. You'll notice here that there was a save button as well. And what this does is saves a working copy of your web page, but doesn't make it live. While save and publish, which is the one that we've been clicking on, saves your changes and makes them live in one hit. Another neat trick the SiteWalk editor has up its sleeve is that you can use it to make your own hyperlinks. There's a hyperlink tool in the corner here. Say you want to make a link, you just select the text that you want to turn to a link. Click on the link manager and enter in the details here, such as the address and whether or not you want to open the link in a new window. The rest of the editor tools work just like a standard word processor. SiteWalk also lets you click on the links on your web pages and follow them as if you were browsing your site. I'll just click on the news and this takes me to my news page, but I'm still inside SiteWalk. However, if you watch carefully, as I hover over the announcements, it gives me the option of directly editing the announcements, not just the text or the layout. Moving on to my online shop. As I mouse over the catalogs inside my online shop, you can see that I've got shop specific options pop up such as edit my catalogs or change my shipping options or change my payment gateways as well. And that wraps up our site walk tour. I hope I've shown you how easy it is to change your website content on your online business. You can now dive deeper into more advanced website topics such as adding and deleting pages, managing content with modules, or changing your menus, or setting up secure zones. You've also got the option of moving on to e-commerce with a link to the e-commerce overview. Thanks for watching and I'll be seeing you next time.